Today we will be talking about what it is and what it takes to be a family nurse practitioner. Many people have never even heard of a family nurse practitioner, but they are an important part of our community. As times have progressed, our need for more medical attention has expanded, but not only for an individual, but for their family as a whole. As our country continues to progress, so do our medical examiners. Now to be a medical examiner, you have to go through a long process to have a specialty. By the end of our presentation, you will understand what it takes to be a family nurse practitioner. Hi, my name is Michael, and I'll be defining the role of a family nurse practitioner. Family nurse practitioners are advanced practice registered nurses who collaborate with other healthcare professionals to deliver family-focused care. Family nurse practitioners offer a wide range of healthcare services that revolve around the family unit, from health promotion and disease prevention to direct care and counseling across the lifespan. What makes family nurse practitioners so unique is their focus on the health and well-being of the whole person. With the focus on health promotion, disease prevention, and health education and counseling, family nurse practitioners guide patients in making smarter health and lifestyle choices, which in turn can lower patients' out-of-pocket costs. Family nurse practitioners are important because they are versatile in their work. They are considered mentors, administrators, and researchers. Their involvement in professional organizations and participation in health policy is within the local, state, national, and international levels. Their contribution helps maintain their reputation as an important role within the medical field. Hello everyone, I am going to talk about the steps to become a family nurse practitioner. First of all, there are several paths that a person can become a family nurse practitioner. People can take the master's degree of nurse practitioner program or they can go straight to the doctorate program. Secondly, the cost for graduate school is expensive, so it is important to financially plan carefully. According to John Hopkins School of Nursing, doctorate program of nurse practitioner estimated cost is around $49,000 for the school years. The amount includes the tuition fee, room and board, textbooks, and other expenses. Also, according to Mid-Level Youth website, the price for nurse practitioner education in public school can be between $20,985 and $35,489, depending on which program you choose and your financial payment plan. The cost for private school is between $52,463 and $88,722. In addition, the tuition fees tend to increase about 3% per year. Next comes the application process. The application requirements depends on the program that the person chooses. Many schools require applicants to have some sort of clinical experiences, about 2,000 to 4,000 hours of direct contact with patients, and an RN license, BSN degree, high GPA, above 3.0, and some of the prerequisites, classes, and D courses vary depending on the school. The length of the program depends on the path that people choose. It varies from 18 months up to 2 years. It also depends on the specialty that the person focuses to study. Finally, after a person finishes his degree, he is eligible to take the national certification exam. If he passes, this exam, he can obtain a license in the state he wants to practice. After that, he needs to obtain a license to prescribe the drugs from the U.S. Drug Enforcement Agency. Now he officially become nurse practitioner. Hi, my name is Tam, and I'm going to share with you the major tasks that family nurse practitioner would do. Once you become a family nurse practitioner, you can either work in a hospital or in a health clinic. With the knowledge of an advanced healthcare provider, you can do a variety of things. For example, you can diagnose and provide treatment for your patients, perform physical examination, interpret the medical test results. Sometimes you can perform minor surgeries. Independent on the state, family nurse practitioner can write prescription as well. As a family nurse practitioner, you will see all types of patients ranging from newborn to the elderly. You also counsel and educate your patients as well. Make sure that they understand their health problems and agree to follow your treatment. Hello, my name is Alex and I'm going to be discussing the family nurse practitioners, 
or FMP salary. A common question about family nurse practitioners is how much money do they make? Are they well off? Well, the salary for a family nurse practitioner in the U.S. is about $85,000 annually. Still, a family nurse practitioner's salary fluctuates minimally with experience. If you are wondering, that adds up to around $43 an hour. So, you may say, that's all fantastic, but what does FNP job availability look like for the future? Well, it looks like you're in luck, because the Bureau of Labor Statistics is predicting a significant increase in new positions for nurse practitioners by 2022. About 37,100 positions are to open up by that time. The future looks bright for nurse practitioners. Nurse practitioners are a benefit to society because they can be hired in a doctor's office to increase the number of patients that can be attended to. This is because, like a doctor, nurse practitioners can provide routine care, order exams, and interpret these exams. Nurse practitioners also tend to have a more sensitive approach to the patient's emotions and psychological needs than a doctor would. This is because they are trained to care for patients in a more holistic manner. Thank you all for your undivided attention. We hope you have enjoyed this presentation and that we were able to answer any questions you had about family nurse practitioners and the steps it takes to become one. Good luck.